hey what's up guys this is king vox and today i want to talk about dungeons and not not dungeons particularly but the dungeon sets now when i first started playing guild wars and i saw like um some you know i think they were like concept art of like dungeon sets and stuff like that and it really piqued my interest because that's exactly kind of like the old stuff that i i want that i wish that would come back and not just guild wars but any other mmorpg out there and i guess think the concept of these sets is just very beautiful you know and here you have let me see i'm only going to be showing the medium sets um for some of these things but these sets were you know catered you know to this dungeon like these these sets were specifically for this dungeon like look at it look at the detail and this set is very beautiful to today actually i want to um you know gather up all the dungeon sets and stuff like that and guild wars over time i just think they're just phenomenal like this set right here is like it's it looks basic or whatever but it looks the detail is very nice on it and i just love stuff like this i love the whole idea of sets and i wish like i know that these were superior arena of the monk or whatever um it's probably almost unique to this um dungeon set but i would like to see some really unique runes or whatever like maybe the dungeon sets um don't have runes and maybe they have their own type of special set bonuses or something like that i would love to see a set type situation like this added into fractals where it, when you raid fractals or when you do fractals the higher you get whatever the um higher rank and stuff like that you get in fractals the more um sets become available to you like a tier list in some words some words and um let's see some others let's see the twilight so here we have the twilight and this is like i said i'm only doing the medium armor um for right now but you guys can definitely go to this vendor i'll show you guys where this vendor is but some of this armor like it doesn't now, right now, when you're looking at it, it doesn't look like the nicest, and that's mainly because it's not dyed. When you dye this armor, it looks very beautiful. Um, just all of them, just something like this. This is just like the tip of the iceberg that today, like, I'll show you um, the heavy version of it. And it just looks, and look at the detail in the chest. Like, these dungeon sets are very beautiful, and actually, I want to collect all of them i'm not sure i don't want to collect all of them for like every single like um type of armor like light heavy and hard and light heavy and um medium Cause that would that would just be way too much work but look at the detail on this stuff like and it, and it will get it looks even better when it's dyed something like pink or like purple um stuff like baby blues like just anything like green toxic greens um so a lot of people look for fashion and guild wars and they forget about these things they they have no clue some people some newer players have no clue that this stuff is actually in the game um let's see if we can i think it starts here but there is man there's a lot of these things in here and a lot of them look really beautiful and i just really don't want these sets to go to waste like you guys should really check out these sets and farm these sets um they're just phenomenal like look at this like for an engineer like tell me this isn't dope you know what i mean like this is like the go-to for an engineer like maybe i would lose the helmet let me see it sucks that i have my helmet on there uh I, there's no way I can like take my helmet off, but imagine this dye like all like black and gray or something like that. It would just look really dope. Like it already looks dope. Imagine you running around with a with a um flamethrower and stuff like that. So this is definitely a set that I'll probably be looking into. Um, let's check out another set. Armor piece. Um, I don't know. Did we check this one yet? No, we haven't. So. We're going to, and like I said, you guys can come here and check these out, but there's a lot of hidden gems here and, and a lot of new players don't even know about this stuff. Like I, there, like I was on, where was I? I think I was on discord or team speak or something like that. 
and I was talking to one of my subscribers, and they were like, I wish there was sets and stuff like that. And again, I was like, there actually is. There's a lot of really cool sets. This set doesn't look too good. Oh, sorry about that. There we go. Sorry about that. But, you know, I was like, there's a lot of sets in the game, and, and they, a lot of them look very beautiful. Let me try to go over this one. This one might even look better. The coloration right now is a little bit off because of the dyes, but it's okay. This is one of the this is one of the less lesser desire ones. Let's see the Citadel of Flame. I think has a very beautiful one as well. I have no badges for that. Actually, if any of you guys want to see some dungeons along with fractals, because I did say that I was going to start a fractal series where I show um fractals as well you know now this is dope now for the light armor like look at look at the flame effects and stuff like that you guys there's a lot of armor sets in the game or whatever that have and cool animations and stuff like that that you guys can really like you know attach to look at this like you you really can look like anything that you want let's see Look at that. That that would be perfect for a necromancer. For like, just look at these sets. Like, they're just very beautiful. Like, and there there's different variants of them as well. I believe. Let me see. My character is really scrawny, so he looks kind of weird with it. But man, there's some. Let me see. There is this. Maybe this right here. And we'll try the ash one next. But we'll see what this is. I think this is really good for like thieves and stuff like that. So, boom. You know, you have these full sets. And look at those gloves. Look how beautiful those gloves. Man, my, my arms are so skinny. Holy crap. But I need to run, I need to run all the dungeons so I can definitely collect all of this stuff because I am very interested in this. Right now, I'm kind of torn between, um, holy snap, this looks cool. Okay, okay. Dude, look at this. Come on, bro. Look at this, guys. You can't tell me how beautiful this is. Like, you can't, you can't say this isn't beautiful. Like... Let me look at the, what is this, the light I'm about to go into right now as well. So you guys definitely look look at dungeons for an option because this stuff is very dope. The helmet is really cool. The helmet reminds me of some type of time traveler. Let's see what this is. I think this is the same, just different stats. But man, this right here, this right here, looks really cool i would love to have this on a character with some type of glowing effect um i'm not sure about the legs yet but man everything else looks really nice i can imagine this on a very bulky character how cool it would look that is just dope i definitely have to hand it to them for this one because this one is definitely beautiful and i I definitely may play my Revenant just to even be able to, like, get this armor. And it, that's kind of what I do. Like, now I just, like, roll classes just to play with stuff. Like, I rolled Thief again just to play with this rifle. You know, maybe I'll get on my Engineer and finish him off, but I'm not quite sure yet. Now, let's look at the last armor set, which I believe is the Ash. And I think we looked at both of these already. So, we'll go here. And then I guess I'll show you guys some weapons. Um, let's actually go down here. I know I was I said I was just going to show um like you know um medium armor, but you know it happens. So if you guys always wonder because you see a lot of necros and stuff like that with these this spec whatever this is where it comes from, right here. So this is actually a pretty tough dungeon, um, but you can get it done definitely. Oh yeah, look how beautiful that is. Just look at that, like, 
look at the detail in that like how cool is that you know for for you dragon hunters out there people that like to hunt down dragons look at the detail in these gloves man this is just absolutely beautiful and i remember back in the day when i first saw these i just thought it was the most amazing thing i've ever seen and even to this day the detail on these sets are just beautiful just look at the detail i'm not a big fan of the whole skirt thing the dress thing i'm more of i like leggings and stuff like that but i can deal with this like this is pretty dope look at this like imagine playing a warrior like this with a like really cool great sword or something um it just look at the detail in this whole set i would love to see all these sets right here implement it into fractals and i know a lot of people are probably like you know fractals has its own theme and, and that's true i would love to see a fractals theme set as well that wasn't over the top but that kind of match the way the weapons you know work and fractals because the fractals have some of the most beautiful weapons and and the, sh the shield i believe the fractal shield is the most beautiful shield in the game and actually that's one of the reasons why I kind of wanted to play Engineer in the first place, just because of that shield. Because I thought the shield was just so beautiful, and especially on an Azorn. But, yeah, let's go and check out some weapons right now. So, you have these weapons. Actually, did I show? This stuff is... These weapons aren't really that cool. This is probably one of the first dungeons that you go, go to, but these weapons they're not like plain basic weapons i know they look kind of plain but look at the detail in some of these weapons they're very beautiful a spear a harpoon it's really cool but as you can see this is it it definitely does match let's see if we looked at that armor because i'm not sure if we had or not and i think we had already yeah we did look at this armor but this armor is very nice too and this is this is the armor set you can get fairly early on and you know you can get this power toughness vitality set as like you know a world versus world set um and world versus world you don't really need that much damage especially if you're playing properly and when i say playing properly i mean you're running around with your group or whatever and taking castles and stuff like that you really just need to survive and that's it like you know what I mean you don't have to worry about anything else so there that there's that and I think I will be getting on my engineer and finishing off a bunch of um quests and living story I'm not sure how much living story videos I'll actually give you guys because I kind of do living story with my wife um, but I'll definitely show you guys some of these dungeons or whatever so you guys know how to do these dungeons as well as trying to get you guys more involved in fractals and if you guys are on my discord I will announce on my discord uh, when I'm getting ready to do fractals and stuff like that just in case any of you guys would like to join me now remember that I am North America so um, if you're in EU, I don't really know. I don't think I can switch to EU or anything to run anything with you, um, sadly. But um, for the people that want to run fractals with me in dungeons and stuff like that, you know, um, we do. We we are building a community of Guild Wars and Discord. Um, right now, there's a lot of Black Desert um, people, and a lot of them are very childish. Um, <laughs> you know, take what they say with a grain of salt, or whatever. Um, I try not to let people be too toxic in there but sometimes you can't really control that type of stuff and you know you don't know when they're gonna be just if you guys feel attacked or anything like that whatever just speak up and say something and i'll take care of it all right guys this has been king fox you guys have a blessed day and i am out